Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate you. And now it's going to be a little Q&A and answer all your questions to the best of my abilities as we move forward. So right now, grab all your questions and let's do this. Let me get rid of this banner. Hmm, 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 hmm. Jayon Chow says, Binance put FTX out of business. In truth, it was FTX who stole money and simply got caught. Yeah. Sam used customer money for political donations and funds were in one pool of different uh, tools level. Sam killed FTX. I have to agree with Jayon Chow on this one. Uh, Chris, hey, Rob, can't believe FTX, a multi billionaire company, used QuickBooks <laughs> for their accounting. May as well have been using cookbooks. Well, they did cook the books. So you're right. Yeah, Ireland better read that. Exactly. Uh, let's see. Yeah, Panda Pi says, for the rate hikes, I find Powell is doing what he said. Didn't change his speech. Still targeting 2% inflation. We'll do it possible. No surprise. It's a surprise to the pundits who think that, you know, the top is in, I mean, the bottom is in, and, and it's going to just, you know, be all awesome moving forward. Remember, and there's a very popular image being skirted around and uh i am uh not it's not beneath me to show this graphic because <laughs> it doesn't make a lot of sense let's see rate hikes where did i put it dollar there it is fed pivot so it looks like this well, I mean, i'm sure you'd like to see what i see it looks like this so just remember that when the Fed pivots, I mean, it's, it sounds awesome, but even when it pivots, it still goes down a great, great amount. So just be aware of that. Um, and it's because they got to break stuff before they can say, okay, mission accomplished. So just be aware that uh, even though when they pivot, it's still got a little more pain to go through. But, you know, if you're dollar cost averaging, good for you. <laughs> Put your big boy pants on when leverage and buying alts. Yeah, put your big boy pants on because usually you don't you don't have a shirt left. So, yeah. Neil says, uh, "Hey, don't know anyone can trust exchanges. Every cycle they mess stuff up. Whether it's a hack, it's true actually. No Gox and I mean even Binance had a hack, using user funds over leverage, losing clients' funds. You can't trust them. Yeah, you know what gets rich with the exchanges, the exchanges themselves, and that's the thing." Uh, and um, I got to tell you, like, if you wanted to make, uh, some things just don't make sense to me. Like, if you're Sam Bankman Fried and you just know, like, look, I'm just going to go serve like five years in jail and then maybe I'll get three years probation. But, you know, eight years isn't bad to be a billionaire. You know, all that money seems to be just gone. We don't know what happened to it. So I don't know. Uh, Darth Mike's is leverage is most likely increasing just because of more availability, ease of access by more and more of the public, I can say. Yeah, that's it. I think that's it. People, <laughs> people need personal responsibility. Screw regulation. Yeah. Yeah. I mean... Nothing really surprises me anymore. So, yeah, Jeff says, How is Alex still Freeman? Alex Mashinsky. Good question, man. Good question. There's a difference between, see, at least they can account for some of the funds. And it's still, it's still mismanagement. But the question is, was there an illegal procedure moving forward? I did just see the, um, the coin list and it looks like don't quote me but it looks like uh alex took out 18 million dollars worth of worth of funds 60 days before the collapse and that could just be a an, an amazing owner's draw but who knows let's see i think yeah bobby so when here if i'll be able to get tax stuff from voyager who knows? I don't know. Um, mm, mm, that's it. So look, I must be doing my job pretty well because no one has questions for me. Great. All right, everybody. So thanks for stopping by. I appreciate you. If you like today's video, thumbs up, subscribe, all that good stuff. 
And that is it for today. So thank you for stopping by. I appreciate it. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Adios. Have a good night. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.